Have you ever been in a relationship that seemed to just suck the life out of you? You ever feel like you are giving, 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 and just never receiving? Maybe you've been the one that was just receiving and not giving. Today I'm going to talk to you about how relationships will either raise your physical frequency or lower your physical frequency. But if you hang on towards the end of this video, I'm going to share a couple of secrets with you about how you can overcome all of that and maintain your high vibes. You are, and I am, frequency. Every single thing that exists on this beautiful planet, including the planet itself, including all things in the universe, and even the space that uh, you're perceiving things through. Everything is vibration. It carries a very specific frequency. And if you're going to be able to hear that, feel that, sense that, you have to tune into that. Now this is the key to overcoming being dragged down or drained by others. But I run into this thing all the time where people are always saying, hey, I'm just so drained, man. I'm so tired of feeling the way that I do. My girlfriend, my boyfriend, my husband, my wife, my friends are just draining me. And um, when that's happening, you have two options. Uh, you can either walk away from that friendship, that relationship, whatever that relationship may be, or you can learn to overcome those low vibes. But the question I have for you is this. Why are you at the frequency that's able to pick up and receive those low vibes? So again, radio signals are flying by us continually. They're just, bzz, 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 just happening, flying by us. And unless I tune my receiver into those frequencies, only then can I pick up that signal. So if I want to listen to uh, Q101, it's a local radio station. I don't listen to it very much, but just happened to be on the in my on in my wife's car while you're driving down the road today. And if I was going to listen to Q101, I got to go to 1.007. And if I'm not exactly at that frequency, I cannot listen to that station. I won't hear it. It is still moving past me. It's still very present. I'm just not tuned into it. So whatever frequency you're picking up, it's because you're tuning into that frequency. So I have a lot of people that are like, man, I just like the positive vibes of this person. That's awesome. I'm glad you like it. But they're also like, I can't stand these low vibes. And the question is, why are you picking up all of the vibes? Why? Why is it that you're tuning in to those frequencies? Why is it that when you're around people with a high vibe, you feel high, and when you're around people with a low vibe, you feel low? And the answer to that is because you are a very tuned-in being between this vibrational frequency. Everything that's coming in, basically, between these hertz and these hertz, in this frequency range, everything that's coming in in that range you're able to pick up and perceive. Now that frequency range could be described as lots of things. Today we're just gonna, I'm sorry, hit the camera, we're just gonna call that um, we're gonna call that beta. And for most people they're operating at a beta frequency and as a result of that beta frequency everything in this range of beta they're able to uh, perceive. And they can be at a very high end or a deep end of beta or a very low end of beta, but they're able to perceive that. And for most people, they're like, man, the ones at the deep end of beta, these are just fucking cool dudes, these fucking cool cats, and the ones at this end, nah, I don't want to hang out with. Now, listen, if that's where you are, nothing wrong with being there. If that's what you're experiencing, nothing wrong with that at all. My encouragement to you is find, discover, set your heart, posture your heart, discover people that are, that are at your frequency, at the frequency you want to hang out with. And in order to do that, you begin to set your heart to be positive, be more positive, and express gratitude and all the things that you want. And that in and of itself will draw those individuals in. Here's the kicker. 
you can transcend all this fucking shit by raising your vibes to a point where you no longer pick up that beta frequency at all. But now you're picking up alpha, you're picking up theta, you're picking up a high frequency. So physically speaking, your body is not turned, it's not um, moving beyond the form where you can't see it, but it's at such a high frequency that your body and your mind is picking up only those high frequencies. Now, I can see you and I can tell you're having an off day. And I'm like, man, that's got to feel like shit. But it doesn't make me feel like shit because I'm not tuned in that frequency. So I have people all the time coming to me. And I used to actually, for those that don't know, I was a pastor. And you can, uh, I was a Christian and I was a pastor. And you can check out this video here. It talks a little bit about why I no longer am that. But as a pastor, I was having people continually come to me, and I still do have people come to me often, and they're like, man, I'm struggling with this, and I need help here, and I don't know what to do about this. And I'm always like, man, you know what? The number one secret, the number one thing to being able to overcome this relation, these relational issues is by you getting so fucking high that it just doesn't matter. And when I get fucking high, what I mean is begin to tap into your divine nature. You begin to tap into your divine nature, and as the divine one, you're releasing all of the beautiful frequencies. You're releasing the dopamine, and you're releasing the anemides and the THC, and all the beautiful chemicals and hormones through your body. And you're getting to choose how your body feels, and no longer do those you're in relationship choose for you how you feel. In other words, they can no longer drag you down. And the key to that is beginning to let go of past mind and slip into a present awareness, a present state of mind. Now, there are so many things that will help raise your vibration. I do encourage you to find those that you're vibing with. And so even if you're, I can, I can put up with anybody. I can deal with anybody because they don't bring me down. But find those but I still like hanging out with people that are vibing with me. Find those that you vibe with and be like, you know what? That person's fun. I enjoy this. I feel them. So even if you have transcended that whole relational issue problem altogether, you still want to find those you're vibing with. And the way that you do that is you begin to a draw and you begin to attract them through your own vibration. Like frequency attracts like frequency. So begin to draw them in through your own attentiveness and and uh, through your own action begin to draw those people into your life whether that's a girlfriend boyfriend husband wife friend whatever it is that you want to draw in you can attract them simply through raising your frequency right raising your frequency and look for those that are responding to the frequency last thing as long as you're trying to fit in be liked uh, get somebody else to like you, you will never know whether or not you're vibing with someone. Because people are all the time trying to get along and that works great right up until they stop because they've never actually been authentic. Be your fucking authentic self, baby. Come on. Don't, don't try to fit in. Instead, Raise your vibration and maintain that and explore that and feel that and sense that and those of like vibration will be drawn to you. But as long as you're trying to lower your vibration to fit into another group, what's going to end up happening is that you're just going to meet people with those low, lower vibrations and you're going to get depressed and you're going to be frustrated and you're going to be irritated and aggravated all the time. You're going to be up and down. So instead, stay, raise the vibration, stay in a positive vibration and attract those that you want. I hope this helps you guys. I love you so much. Check out the next video. Please comment whatever questions you have below. And if you haven't subscribed, do so already. Last.